Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel, We're the Movie Couple. I'm Wendy. I'm Dustin. And we're about to check out the trailer for Malcolm and Marie. This stars John David Washington and Zendaya, and it's coming soon to Netflix. And just kind of based on the description here, and I know we're a bit late to, to this, but the description is, when filmmaker Malcolm, played by John David Washington, and his girlfriend Marie, played by Zendaya, return home from a movie premiere and awaits his film's critical response. The evening takes a turn as revelations about the relationship surface, uh, testing the couple's love. So, uh, very excited to kind of see this because I really, I, I've been really liking Zendaya's kind of acting career, following her all the way from, gosh, was it like Disney or whatever yeah. she was I think on? Yeah, I think she started off in doing Disney I stuff. I think so too. Um, I didn't follow her then, but to kind of, watch her grow you know as her with her role in uh spider-man with her role in the greatest showman mm -hmm. uh, and then euphoria is i feel like she really really got to like just a whole side of a whole nother side of her that i've never seen before as an artist so i've been really enjoying her performance and of course john david washington who doesn't like him uh <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and check it out i, I like that oh no it started i like that it's in black and white I'm a little curious on yeah how it's gonna get um how it's gonna change the mood yeah of it being now in black and white because we still get the crisp te um high tech camera picture that we get but now it's just normally when you think of black and white you normally think of older movies to where the quality isn't as crisp as it mm -hmm. is now but yeah to um actually choose to make a movie in black and white I think that's is a very cool. it's a very bold artistic choice nowadays yeah and that's what i'm expecting is like just artistry yeah <laughs> exactly trailer. so we'll go ahead and check it out right now you are by far the most excruciating difficult stubbornly obnoxious woman i've ever met in my entire life <laughs> i fucking love you oh <laughs> okay oh he's so sensitive he's <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, well, when he's not being an emotional fucking terror. Uh, <laughs> oh. Up low to the way you see the world, Marie. Hi, hi, low lows. Yep, yep. Sam Marcus. Mystery. Mm. Uh, the unknown. It's what supports the tension of a relationship. You're angry. No. The what if factor. Marie. Okay. Boiling over. What if hmm. there's someone who loved them better? Whoa. Give me your man. Okay. Give me your song. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me I like that mind. shot there. Kind care. of looking at the mirror. Yeah. You know what, Malcolm? I feel like once you know someone is there for you, and once you know they love you. You never actually think of them again. Hmm. Until you're about to lose someone that you finally pay attention to. Huh. Well, what is it, Marie? What do you want? Really? You want to go there? Yes. Okay. Oh, oh she looks like she's she's, she's playing right. sassy in this, too. Like, she's... Oh, she, I don't care, man. This is going to be... An, I, this is going to be an interesting. I want control. Because you can't imagine the reason I'm with you is because I am. Interesting. Everything that you've been through, everything, that's what made you you. The girl that I love, the girl that I fuck with. Oh, wow. All I wanted tonight was thank you, Malcolm. That is it. You know that I'm thankful. You know that I made a mistake. So why turn it into something more? Because about how you see this relationship. Huh. Look at me. I'm the last person standing. Looks like it all takes place in this one house. It's, I think it's the same night. Oh. I think it's or well, we know that it starts from them coming home from his like movie premiere. Yeah. Uh, as it says in the description, and then kind of, you know, going from the the height and the excitement of coming from like maybe seemingly a glamorous event because you know we see them in their suits and mm -hmm. she's got she's got a beautiful outfit on to kind of unraveling at home and. Maybe they had a fight. Uh, we don't know. We haven't seen it yet. But maybe they had a fight before they left mm -hmm. for the event. And maybe she feels like she's taken a second seat to his films, to his 
his work. She doesn't that appreciate it. That is a good possibility. And, uh, or there, they come home and they're of, on that high of, hey, our movie just came out. Or this his is movie. the pre- his movie just mm-hmm. my movie just came out. Big premiere, yay! And then he starts getting the word of um, what the, the critics what the critics are saying, and then kind of kindles some old resentment between the two of them. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that comes out. But I think that I I like this because, and I like that it's black and white because you're not then focused on that. You're focused on the words that they're, and the yes. emotions that they're portraying. And I like that it's, they go from the glamorous to the very raw where you see her, both of them kind of just, just at, in their at-home outfits where they're outside taking a walk where John David or Malcolm's, you know, should I say the character of Malcolm, kind of like going outside and just like yelling into the void kind of mm-hmm. because you're frustrated and, and you're angry because you're like, I love you so much, but you're so fucking annoying. <laughs> like, like, you know, you and I, for example, have been together for so long and people are kind of like, oh, well, like, you know, being married is, is easy and it's kind of like you don't stop working at a relationship just because you got married. Yeah. That's of when I you don't should know, put in more work. I don't know who actually has ever said being married is easy. Um, Probably I'll, magazines. Like those, you know, those like fluff. fluff. Yeah. I, I won't name names, but those, some, some of those fluffy magazines like... Okay, okay. Yeah, maybe whatever. maybe it's like, oh yeah, just follow these ten simple <laughs> ten simple things happy and you'll marriage. for a happy marriage. <laughs> ten ways to please your man. Ten yeah. ways I yeah, all of those little all you have to do is follow these steps and you can live happily ever. There's after. no playbook for a relationship or a marriage. Yeah. Everyone is is different, you know, and people are like, Oh, you know, like what like and, and I I'm excited to see how this is going to play out in, in this film and see, because I don't think they're married. I think they're just in a relationship. Mm. Not not that it, it matters, because a relationship, it, to me, is, is a relationship, and they, yeah. they all need work if you are willing to put in the work, if you if you are willing to work for that person because you love them so much. Uh, so I'm very curious to see this. This comes out at the beginning of February, February 5th, uh, on Netflix, so we will definitely tune in and, and give it a watch. Uh and it feels also very, maybe because it's black and white, feels very, like, stage theatrical to me. Like a play. Yes, honestly. And since it does also seem to take place in one location throughout the right. entire movie, it really does give you kind of that, yeah, theatrical stage that you're going to go see a play. Yeah, I love as that. As opposed, and even the black and white of it mm-hmm. kind of gives you that vibe. So, I mean, I think that's what this movie is just really going to hit home in. Is to have that, I'll probably that art, yeah, that <laughs> artistic flavor to it, and it's going to be a deep. It's going to be a deep movie about relationships. Yes. So I'm excited to see how these actors portray this, which looks like very deep dive into human emotions mm-hmm. and just the concept of relationships in general. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you guys, there you go. That's our thoughts on the trailer for Malcolm and Marie. Let us know what you thought of the trailer in the comment section below. And, of course, list a movie that you've enjoyed that kind of dives into this sort of relationship, uh, kind of a peek back, whether it's at a relationship or a marriage as well, where it really focuses on on the uh, the emotional aspect of it. For example, Marriage Story. That's that's one where I was like, oh, we're going to go there with this movie. Okay, so anyways, let us know what you thought of the trailer in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, uh, and we will see you in the next video. Bye!